See? I knew this was the right way! We sure haven't seen this place before. Oh, you're right! What a relief. I never thought we were going to make it out of the city. And it's all thanks to you, Heart. Actually, it's all thanks to Minerva. She did a great job distracting you. Oh, you mean back when I tried to take that shortcut? I thought it was a great idea at the time, but clearly you and Minerva had the right idea. The problem now is this darn door. It won't budge. Yeah, I've tried pushing and pulling as hard as I can and nothing. Um, pardon me. Is anyone home? Nothing. Let's check around the door to see if there's anything we can find. Celica, wait! It's dark! You need to watch your... Huh? of the suspicious noise confirmed. Fell down the trap door, huh? You all right? Oh, I getcha. So you were protecting your master, but you got split up after you saved her from the trap. It doesn't appear you've sustained any damage. To be honest, we are both victims of the trap door as well. We have been searching for a way back up. But when we heard someone else fall in after us, we ran on back to check it out. And now here you are. Don't worry, there's gotta be a path back up. You wanna find your master, right? Then why don't you tag along? Of course you're welcome to join us. We are always happy to meet a new bud. Now what are we waiting for? I'm Labrys, and this is Igus. Minerva-san, is it? Roger, glad to have you aboard. There was a room-like space just through here. Let's investigate that first. Couldn't have said it better myself. That's the spirit. Oh, come on. This is just a regular room. It is set up like a living room. Is this someone's home? Right? There's no sign of anyone. It's strange. Girl power explosion! Ba -bum, ba -bum. Heart catching challenge! <laughs> stop! I just stop with the bullets! It's me! Just me! Oh, that voice. Hello, system son. I accidentally issued a counterattack. How could you accidentally bring out big guns like that in such a nice living room, no less? How's the room got anything to do with it? You're one weird lady. So, what are you doing here anyway? My arrival can mean only one thing, that it's time for a challenge. A challenge? Then this is a checkpoint? And here we were, looking for an exit! Let's take it from the top once more. You ready for the title call? Girl Power Explosion! Ba -bum, ba -bum. Heart Catching Challenge! 
Huh? Looks like that needs a little explaining. Okay, this challenge is a battle of spirit, technique, and above all, feminine charm. We're getting practical here, ladies. I've arranged a very special guest for this challenge. The special lady who most successfully captures this fella's heart wins! Captures his heart. Now, let's bring out the lucky bachelor. Drum roll, please. Here. Thank you ever so much for being our guest today. Let's give it up for Yosuke Hanamura! This earnest young lad has been shot down by many a beautiful girl. His undateability is a well-established fact. Unchanging since ancient times. Yes, it's true. That's definitely not true! Stop making me your guinea pig for all this stupid stuff! Anyway, today is the day that all changes. Our lovely contestants will be tasked with capturing his heart. Really make it skip a beat with your given criteria. Bring it on! I ain't really following, but if you want us to grab his heart, I got grip power for days, my guy! Yes, I too have equivalent hand strength. Huh? Yo, hold up! Quick huddle for a sec here! What's up? I just wanted to make sure. These beautiful girls you're talking about are these three here, right? Yes, that's right. Okay, so they're cute and all, but, uh... Be honest with me here. You have a type, don't you? I haven't the foggiest idea what you're talking about. Huddle over, swiggity swoo. We're ready to woo! Time for the first trial. All right, I'll win him over with my sexy accent. I'm really not looking forward to this. Our first criterion is hospitality. Uh, hospitality? You heard me. We brought our bachelor all the way here to be a part of this challenge. After such a long trip, you can bet he's parched. Ladies, your challenge is to win his heart with a refreshing homemade beverage. We have to make his heart skip a beat. I see. Yeah! Basically, it's why guys get all weird when a girl does something cute and sweet for them. Aw, I don't know about genius. I have been studying up on human society, though. Alright, let me go first. I gotta make a real heart stopper of a drink, right? Let me see here. A little of that. A little of this. Hey, that's a lot of different ingredients you're putting in there. What are you even making? I think the look of the drink is key. Seeing something cute makes your heart skip a beat, right? Is it? Impressive, big sister. So what I need is a little of this and... Ooh, let's give that a try. Then I'll mix these together and... Ugh, that's too gloppy for anyone to drink. Oh, maybe I'll lighten it up with some soda. Ooh, that should be refreshing. Huh? Oh, <laughs> now we're cooking with fire. You really brought your vision to life. People will be lining up around the block to order one of these. Okay, hanamura kun it's ready. Uh, okay, so this is a pink juice? Honestly, it looks pretty tasty. And cute. Right? What are you waiting for? Bottoms up! Uh, sure. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Why'd you spit it out? <laughs> what is even in this thing? I couldn't even tell if it was supposed to be sweet or sour. Really? 
You're telling me that you aren't ready for the flavor of the Labrys Lovely Pink Soda? Can, can, can I see the ingredients? I mean, I guess. Here. Oh, are you kidding me? Ketchup and condensed milk should never go together! In anything! Stopped you hot, though, didn't it? Not in a good way. It nearly sent me into shock. It doesn't taste at all like it looks. Aw, you didn't like it? I wonder why. Because it was unbelievably disgusting, that's why! Got it. So, disgusting is not what people look for in a drink. Bummer. I believe it is my turn next. If there's one thing to take away from that last round, don't focus too much on the way it looks. Roger that. Just relax. Your drink is in capable hands. My strategy? Because Hanamura-san advised me to avoid focusing on looks, I am focusing entirely on substance instead. In addition to telling us to make his heart skip a beat, System-san specifically used the word capture. That hint provided the basis for my beverage. Now you got me really curious. In order to capture someone's heart, you need to make an impact. Something that really shakes them to their core. Something like this. It is finished. You were working for quite a while. So what kind of hospitality are you about to show me? An impactful hospitality. Impactful? Wait, what the hell is that? Trying to drink that might kill me! Correct. I would not recommend drinking it. This beverage has a trick to it. All I have to do is mix in this other liquid and... Oh, Hanamura-san, I suggest you stand back. Uh... Here we go. Oh, oh, wait, oh, what are you? Ah! Man, talk about making an impact. That was a big boom. The sweet sound of success. That was terrifying. What do you mean success? Your drink exploded. But was it impactful? Sure it was. Impactful to my psyche and well-being. In other words, I've captured your heart. How? How did what I just say lead to what you just said? Was I wrong? Super wrong! So wrong! That did the opposite of capturing my heart! How unfortunate. Then my plan was a failure. Uh, yeah. Would it have been so hard to give me a normal drink instead of trying so hard to be eccentric? Hmm? <gasps> Did you come up with an idea, Minerva? Go ahead, you're up! Oh no! What's going to try to kill me this time? Huh? <sighs> this looks... No! No way! I'm not letting my guard down that easy! There's gotta be something nightmarish in it! It's... It's good! It's regular old tea! It's so deliciously safe! <laughs> Whoa! If she captured his heart any harder, she'd have crushed it in her hand! Is that true, Hanamura-san? Oh, well... Huh. I... I guess she really did capture my heart. I never thought I'd be so moved by a single drinkable beverage, but here we are. Way to go, Minerva! Oh, stop being so modest. I never knew you brewed such a mean tea. Talk about feminine charm. You learned by watching your master? Fascinating. Huh. Clearly, a good teacher makes all the difference. Minerva cleanly takes the first round by serving him the only decent drink. Oh, 
losing like that stings. But Minerva's tea smells so good, there was no way I could compete. Now, are you ready to move on to our second trial where the scores can really change? This trial's criterion is heart-pounding action. Action? Perfect. I excel at physical maneuverability. Ooh, spicy! You've got to take that extra mobile body of yours and use it to perform some sort of action. The lady who captures our guest's heart most completely with said action is the winner. What kind of action are you talking about here? You want them doing kung fu or something? If that's what moves them, they can take any sort of action they want. Sure, it's vague, but that's part of the fun. They can raise their hand or sing a song. Whatever gets your little heart pitter pat. An action that gets his heart going. Hmm. I I'm coming up empty here. Why don't we team up for this one, big sister? Huh? You got a plan already, I guess? I do. With your cooperation, the plan's projected efficacy increases by 200%. Oh, I like those odds! Count me in! Based on my analysis, I believe that... What could they be planning? Uh, girls! You're kind of scaring me here! Can you at least scheme louder so I know what I'm up against? Yeah, that just might work! Yeah! Let's give it a shot! Make his heart go pitter-pat. Heart can be used in either the romantic sense, like the soul, or the physical sense, like the organ. Pitter-pat. A rapid, powerful beat. Possibly irregular. This brings us to one conclusion. Uh-oh, I know where this is going! This is our answer! Ah, I knew it! Please, just put those away! Good! Heart rate increase confirmed. Well, duh! You just pointed a gun in my face for crying out loud! I'm terrified! Ah, uh, doesn't that mean your heart's going pit-a-pat? Not at all! It's more like it's beating out of my chest! Pitter-pat is a good feeling! This challenge is far more complicated than anticipated. Not if you think before you act! Oh, what am I saying? You thought it over and decided to point a gun at me! All of this is supposed to be like a fake date! There's a million normal, gentle things you could do! Huh? Minerva, what are you doing putting your hand on Hanamura-kun's head like that? I believe this is called a head pat. Head pat? That is right. It is the act of placing one's hand atop another's head to caress them. It is said to have a soothing effect. Perhaps Hanamura-san is currently undergoing that. Can you stop with the clinical explanation already? At this point, you're just making this even more embarrassing. You, you don't have to stare at me like that. And you can stop petting me now, too. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have a pitter pat. Oh, come on! What? You're telling me your heart didn't just go pitter pat? Well, fine, maybe a little. There it is from the man himself. Minerva now leads with two points. Congratulations! Your head pat strategy worked like a charm. Is this another thing you learned from your master? Huh? Goes to show how much you can learn when you hang out with a human every day, I guess. Got any other tricks up your sleeve? Anything we should know? You know, something to make people light up. You've been full of surprises so far. If you teach me your skills, I can get even closer to everybody, right? I see. That is a good idea. 
Please teach me, too. Oh, I know. We should ask System to give us another round so Minerva's got some place to start from. As you command. The trials shall continue until you're all good and taut. I can come up with loads of them. Oh! How much longer are you going to force me to stick around here? Thank you for your cooperation, Hanamura-san. This is the opposite of cooperation! I'm not doing this! You can't make me! Well, sounds like we're doing this. I'm ready! As am I. Let's see here. We've gone through 20 trials so far. You gals still hungry for more? Please, let me go. I think we can call it a day now. Thanks for teaching us so much, Minerva. I have learned so much. It has entirely changed my perspective on how to engage with people. Seriously, thanks so much. Your master sounds like a real nice lady. <gasps> oh, wait! What is the matter? Minerva's master! Oh, we were supposed to be looking for her and I completely forgot! Oh, that is right. We were completely preoccupied with the challenge. Oh, no kidding! Oh, let's wrap this up and go find her! Uh oh, but before we do, you better give Minerva her stamp. Yes, yes, man, you guys got so carried away with this one. Let me tally up the points here. So, after a whopping 20 trials... Despite Labrys and I just catching up in the latter half, Minerva still emerges victorious. So, here you go. A special stamp just for you. Nice work there! Ah, oh, your master's gonna be really happy about this one. It was an honor to fight alongside you. Thank you for everything that you have taught us. So, uh, what about me? Oh, right. Yeah, we're done with you. I'll put you right back where you came from. Thanks for dropping in. Huh? He vanished! Don't worry, I just sent him back to his ragtag group of friends. He'll be fine. Anywho, that about does it for our challenge. You can exit through that door right there, so step lively now. Huh? I don't remember that door being there before. Let us relocate outside for now. I would like to verify our current location. Yeah, I'm down. Fresh air at last! Now, let us search for Minerva-san's master. <gasps> there you are! Look hard! Over there! It's Minerva! There she is! I was getting worried! Well, that wasn't much of a search. Hey! Over here! Minerva, I'm so glad you're safe! She was really worried about you! You better not get separated like that again. We won't. Thank you so much for staying with her. You are very welcome. Minerva, is that a stamp? <gasps> huh? Oh, you're right! You got this all on your own? You're amazing, Minerva. <laughs> you guys sure like each other, don't you? Perhaps this is the feeling of having your heart go pitter-pat. Hmm, it might just be. That feeling is called love! At least I think it is. Love. Understood. Good to know. Well, we better go. Let's get back to investigating, I guess. Roger. Minerva-san, ma'am, please excuse us. Oh, okay. Hope to see you again soon. 
And thanks a lot. Bye-bye! See ya! Ta-ta for now. Well, if Minerva's cleared this checkpoint, we should probably move on too. Good thinking. All right, I'm gonna find us a shortcut. My gut says... this way. Huh? You wanna go the other way, Minerva? But... Uh, hey! I get it, you don't have to pull on me like that. Sorry, Heart. I'm not sure why, but Minerva's being stubborn. <laughs> I think it's okay to let her have her way every once in a while. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Okay, lead the way, Minerva. <laughs> <laughs>